It's the final day of the Coaches vs. Cancer Tournament, the final game as the Stags take on South Dakota. Amadou Sadibi with a message to his team before the game. Focus, give it all you got today, all right? 40 minutes of intensity, urgency. Box out, help each other out, all right? And we'll win. Let's go! Play hard on three. One, two, three. Play hard. That's Tyler Nelson on the bench getting his first career start, and the spotlight would be on him all game long. But first, let's look at Sadibi. He was a force inside. Fairfield made their first four shots and six of their first seven as they jump out to a 14-5 lead. That's when it became the Tyler Nelson show. He showed his ability everywhere today. Offensively, there's a fadeaway, nothing but net. Defensively, there's a steal, rushes it up the court and easily lays it in, and that regained the Stags' lead. And from long range, 11-point lead now for the Stags in the second half, and he wasn't even close to being done. His second three-pointer of the game, and he didn't even hit rim. He had his first three shots from behind the arc and his first four shots from the floor in his first career start. And even passing this one down low to Mike Kirkland, that ignited a 10-2 run for the Stags, and this tip-in from Sadibi gave Fairfield another momentum shift up by five with 11 and a half to play. The Coyotes though kept chipping away into every Fairfield lead. Now it's just three, but Tyler Nelson again. His fourth of the game, he would finish with 24 points. And let's not forget Kirkland. He would also reach the 20 point plateau. This was part of a 12-4 run for Fairfield and gave them an 11 point lead with five minutes remaining. Less than a minute to go, South Dakota down by two. Marcus Gilbert on the defensive side blocks the tying attempt, but it goes out of bounds, so South Dakota gets another chance and they would take advantage. Tyler Larson with 40 seconds remaining forces the game to go into overtime, Fairfield's first overtime game this season. The Stags would outscore South Dakota by eight in the extra frame. Here is Sadibi with a tip in, fifth career double-double for the captain. And then to cap off the night, it was Gilbert. One of four stags in double figures as Fairfield wins their first home game of the season, 80 to 72 in overtime. What you guys are seeing from Tyler Nelson, we've seen from day one. You know, uh, we really loved him recruiting wise. You know, he kind of got under recruited and we saw from day one in practice, um, he's gotten better defensively and he's kind of learned our system both defensively and offensively and he's getting into a groove so people are going to start keying on him you know there are going to be some times where he comes up short but man he can shoot and he can pass and he makes things better for us offensively i um, mean yeah, it's all confidence you know coach told me from the beginning of the year you know be confident don't lose confidence keep playing keep working and you know i think i've done that so the last few games i've played pretty well well obviously uh great gutsy win you know south dakota played tremendously hard it took a lot from us emotionally and physically to come back uh, three games in three days and do what we did. So I, I couldn't be prouder. You know, obviously we didn't finish great uh, at the end of the game, but man, it, I'm almost speechless. I'm really proud of them, and I think this team's going to be good, and I think the character of them shows up. That's what's going to carry us a long way.